So I'm very excited to announce through G Fiber Labs, we will be going to market at the end of this year with a symmetrical 20 gig product with Wi-Fi 7. This is an incredible moment for us, but this is the first time we're breaking that 10 gig speed barrier. Another great day for 25 gig point today. I've spoken to Nick to find out a little bit more about today's announcement. We're here at NetworkX and we're excited to announce our latest multi-gig internet offering. Uh, we'll be offering a 20 gig internet service uh, in select markets by the end of this year for our residential customers. We actually already have a few 20 gig customers up and running today. Um, we've been field trialing the service for several months uh, with select customers in, in certain markets, including UMKC in Kansas City and United Way of Utah County in Provo, Utah. Two continents, two 25 gig pawn announcements. Momentum is really building. I'm going to ask Heert why we are building this momentum. Very clearly, there's a lot of traction because basically, if you think about the technology, it's a very easy way to deploy it and do existing network. If you look at the case for Nokia, each and every 10 gig port that we have shipped so far is 25 gig capable. So we already have 1 million lines out there which are capable of being upgraded to 25 gig. So it's a simply replacement of an optic. You put it on an existing optical plant and this is the way you deploy 25 gig. 20 gig allows us to break that 10 gig speed barrier, which is super critical for us. Very thankful for Nokia's 25 gig pond technology to enable us to do that. First of all, I want to say I'm super excited on what happened with NBN and Google. They are really bringing 25 gig to the consumer market, which is, which is enormous. There's tons of use cases for gig plus speeds today, whether it's AR, VR, 4K streaming, multiple devices in the home. But obviously, indeed, 25 gig is a very high speed, not each and every consumer would need it. So you're looking at other applications. Joe and Telecom actually did a trial to use it for mobile applications and not just for backhaul, which is basically what's also have been done by Telecom Italia, but also for front haul. So even from a front haul perspective, with very, very stringent latency requirements, 25 gig is a perfect match. So we have created an MSA, which is basically a consortium of different companies who are really eager to bring the ecosystem further and to make sure that 25 gig is a success. We have more than 50 companies who are participating in the MSA. And this is across all different elements of the companies. It's like test equipment, it's about optical components, it's about optical plugins, it's about OLT providers, it's about ONT chips. So all of them are part of that ecosystem. And hence, it's very clear that 25 gig is going to be very successful. So that's it for today. Till now, we have been talking about the connectivity to the home, but tomorrow, you'll know more about the connectivity inside the home. That's it for today. Bye-bye.